Neighbors in Cooperstown are searching for answers tonight after two people were found dead inside a burning home early this morning. News Force Courtney Allen has more tonight on what we're learning. Courtney. Marius law enforcement has been on scene all day trying to figure out what happened at this home on Errol Dallin Road. Two bodies. Too young to die. Found inside a burning home. Undoubtedly, there was a pretty good fire over there. Just a couple doors down from Wayne Nicholson. And it worried me. That, that's the reason I went up there twice, you know, to ask them what went on. This video from our partners at Smoky Barn News shows law enforcement on scene. This comes after Cooperstown Police says a neighbor called this morning to report a structure fire at the home. I don't know if it's a total loss. However, when they did gain entry, um, a lot of black smoke did come out. Um, so it's pretty significant damage done to the to the home. Inside, authorities found the bodies of a man and woman between the ages of 20 and 30. It's unclear if the deceased are residents of the home and what their relationship is. Nicholson says a young couple moved into that home about a year ago. They didn't bother anybody. Uh, I, I'd call them good neighbors. Other neighbors tell News 4 that the people who live here argue frequently. Cooperstown Police says due to suspicious items they found inside the home, they called the Robertson County District Attorney who requested TBI to investigate. And the TBI guy come down here to talk to me and he asked me have I heard anything like gunshots. And I told him yes last night before seven o'clock. I heard quite a few of them, but I can't say where they was at because I didn't come outside to look. At this point, it's unclear if foul play is suspected and what their official cause of death is. Nicholson says he wants to know more. As close as I'm here, they need to tell us something. TBI says this investigation remains active and ongoing. Marius. Courtney, thank you.